Jay Gardner, a graduate of Minnetonka High School and three years at the University of Wisconsin. Did any of that education prep you for what you were doing here today? I don't think so. This is uh, this is pretty special. I mean, it's a huge deal. I didn't know much about horse racing, and uh, it's cool to hear some of the jockeys talk. And um, yeah, it's fun to be here. My chief scout uh, in Minnesota, a guy named John Gardner, said, uh, as draw masters go, you were the worst at taking draws when you played forward. So this is a bit of an ironic twist here today. Yeah, I wasn't, wasn't too good, so hopefully I was a little bit better at this. It's been a month since uh, that tough loss to Boston. I know you've had to put up with a lot of talk, but uh, what an effort it was back then. Has four weeks helped soothe things as you get prepared for next September? Yeah, right away I think a lot of us were pretty upset. and I mean, we still are. It's, it's calmed down a little bit. and. Uh, the, the feeling isn't, isn't too horrible now. It's, uh, it's more of a get prepared for next year and, and go to work. And, uh, you know, a lot of asking, uh, what did the Leafs do against Boston that the Rangers and Pittsburgh were not able to do? Uh, how important would team speed be in all of that? Yeah, I think uh, we were really fast, and uh, both that and physical. I think, um, you know, they're a physical team as well, and I think we matched up well against them, and obviously they came out on top. But... Uh, and I hope, hopefully, uh, Blackhawks can give them a little bit more than the last two teams have. You personally, uh, what a season it was. You had such a great start, and then, of course, the injury in early December. Did you prove something to yourself as to how well you can play, especially with what you were able to do in that postseason? Yeah, I mean, I didn't have the greatest year. I think, uh, my, obviously, the playoffs was a lot better for me. I, I played more minutes. and. I uh, thought I was a lot more confident out there, and I think that'll help carrying over to next year. But you never calculate getting rocked the way you did. You might have been the best player in the American Hockey League up until that point when Kevin hit you behind the Marley net. Yeah, I wasn't. Uh, I mean, you never want to get hit like that, but uh, I'm not going to make any excuses for anything. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it, it could have caused something that, that made it maybe lingered uh, throughout the season. You're skating with Barb Underhill. You're back here for a short while. How short an offseason is it going to be to get you where you want to be in this Maple Leaf Hockey Club, given all the promise it has heading into the 13-14 season? Yeah, well, we're very excited for next year, and um, we want to finish the way we ended. Obviously not the last game, but the way we were playing. And um, Yeah, the guys are going to be working hard, and uh, we'll be training hard and being ready for next year. As a Wisconsin alum, are you looking ahead to the outdoor classic at Ann Arbor? Oh, very excited. We played in one of those at, uh, in Madison, and uh, we won that one 3-2 against Michigan, and hopefully we can win this one too.